Hey guys, it's Max. I'm really sorry about last week. I didn't get a chance to make a video because I was super busy. Um, so I'm going to do a doubled up topic this week. Last week's topic was swimming, which I guess is a good topic to miss because I don't have much to say about this. I wear a surf shirt and surf shorts and really nothing underneath or a sports bra. I've heard of guys swimming with their packers in, but I've also heard that that could damage it. So I thought that would be cool to have it while I was swimming, but at the same time I don't want it falling out of my shorts while I'm swimming and then like floating around the pool. That would be really awkward for everyone else. Um, this week's topic is self-harm and drug abuse. Both of those things are very bad and do not ever mess around with them. I had a period of time when I was younger with some self-harm issues and it really it doesn't pay off. Nothing. There's nothing good about it. I can understand when some people get addicted to it, and they have to. And I can't blame you for that. I'm not gonna say, like, you have to stop, or you're stupid for doing it. I just, I usually like. I have a few friends, or one in particular. Um, like, you always get the people that say, like, promise me you'll never hurt yourself again and that's impossible to do I have promised a few people that in my past and I broke all of those promises you can never do that when someone is in like deep depression in the moment they don't remember the promises they made so you can't blame those people and you can't expect them to just stop because it's not that easy I don't think you could truly understand unless you were um abusing yourself at one point. I mean, I understand because I was in that situation, but at the same time I know it didn't help me. I'm not where I am today because I caught myself in the past. It's not like it got me through anything. It just gave me stupid scars that I wish I never did. So, it's just, there's no need for it. I, I do have a problem with punching things. I do hurt my knuckles a lot. And I guess that would be a form of self-abuse. I have some anger issues that I have to take care of. I think that's better than cutting yourself, though. Because it's not really permanent, unless you were to break your knuckles. But I'm not really punching things that are going to do that, I guess. Uh, any type of self-harm is bad. Try to steer away from it, and I'm not going to blame you if you feel like you need it. Because it is feels like a release sometimes, but it's just not good. Um, drug abuse. That is just pointless. I'm not even going to talk about it for that long because it's just totally fucking dumb. Don't do drugs. That's it. It's pointless. Okay. See you next week.